Namaste South Tribe Spiritual Healer back to give you guys a message. This message is for my fire signs, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Hi, fire signs. Hope you're all well and safe. I love you guys so much, my beautiful fire signs. I got some channel messages. I've been getting these messages since earlier. Okay, and um, throughout the day, I kept getting different messages here. And I heard a couple names while I was getting messages, too. Because, um, let me just get into this message real quick. Let me get into the channel messages. Let me clear the energy. Spirit guides and angels, ancestors, Holy Spirits, Archangel Michael. Clear the energy for this fire sign reading. Don't let any dark energy or karmic energy disrupt the energy of this reading from us getting the truth. Give us the messages. Give, give us the clarity. Cleanse this energy for this reading, spirit guides and angels. Thank you so much, okay? Okay, my beautiful fire signs. I'm getting a couple messages for you guys today, okay? Um, I feel like you guys are like um, rising. You guys are shining. You guys are um, just expanding your higher consciousness, your knowledge, your spiritual callings, you know? Like, you guys are... Um, receiving a lot of channel messages you guys are hearing messages you guys are increasing in your intuitive gift your psychic gifts are very increased at this time but you're working hard on yourself right and you're like doing better you're act you're gaining some wealth you're starting your businesses you're doing good you're healing yourself from the past people you don't want nothing to do with the past people that's what i'm getting some of you guys are still dealing with um someone that's actually shady Maybe you're still involved with this person. Maybe you're still seeing this person. Maybe this person comes in and out of your energy often. And then um, you don't hear from them. But you're being guided to let this energy go if you're still dealing with someone like this. Because this, these past people or these toxic karmic people or energies, they're trying to keep you guys stuck, right? And they see that you're about to be successful for your hard work because they're literally getting readings on you guys, okay? So there's a lot of people... Um, that are watching this video, Aries Leo Sag, and you're dealing with karmics that are getting readings on you guys that already know you're about to get your blessing and they see you being coming successful. So they're literally going to try to come back into you, get into your good graces, get into your energy again. They're going to come back because um, they wanted to sabotage what you're working on. And that's what I'm getting. I wrote it down here. So it's like the past people are angry that you're not broken, that you're awakened and confident, trying to figure out how to come back and sabotage you because they're envious. Be careful, guys. Be very careful when taking anybody back into your life from the past that you walked away from. Remember that the past is a lesson and moving forward, that is your blessings. Okay, fire signs. So your blessings are up ahead. There's nothing back there in the past. I feel like... um. Some of you guys might be reuniting with someone from the past, but this wasn't the person that actually gang stalked you, that worked against you, that was slandering your name, that was doing black magic on you. This is not that person. Just remember, the person that was that narcissist in your life, you cannot take that person back. That person is still in low, low karmic energy. That person is... It hasn't changed. They want to sabotage you guys. This is what I'm getting. This is the important messages. Okay? So you guys, you have someone new that is waiting to offer you something that is coming in to give you a good offer or a business proposition here that sees your worth and your value that's admiring you guys, fire signs. And the past is still holding on to you. That's what I'm saying. Your past is still holding on to you. They're bitter because someone in your past could have walked away from you and um got caught up chose a karmic over you, and now they're regretful because the the grass wasn't greener on the other side. That's the song I keep hearing in my head by Chris Brown every time because the grass wasn't greener. So um, you guys are literally moving forward, um, getting into your calling, starting your businesses, becoming successful, glowing up, being recognized in love. You guys have more options than somebody new is, is admiring you guys, fire signs, okay? Somebody new is admiring you guys. Somebody new is recognizing you guys. And somebody new is trying to come in, right? And so that's what you guys have to be aware of. And that the past is trying to come in and sabotage it, okay? So um, 
this karmic family that slandered your name and sending you spells. Yeah, there's a karmic family member or family members that you guys might be ha might have that been um sending you spells and trying to keep you guys stuck because they're covering something up, fire signs. Um, they're accusing you, they're um blaming you, they're calling you crazy, they're doing the most. Yeah, and now they're scared because they feel like you're sending curses to them. And it's not true, guys. You guys are not doing this, but it's because the black magic they've been doing on you guys has backfired. It's backfiring, so they're shook. They 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 over here thinking that you guys are doing spell work to them, but you're really not. You're just lighting your protection candles. You're just protecting your energy with spiritual baths, and this shit's hitting them back, you know? Things are becoming clear. Don't go back to the past. It's a trap. This is a main message for some of you guys watching. Don't go back, back to the past. They're trying to trap you back in that toxic energy, ruin your good blessings or benefit off of you. New money, new love, and a new life. That's what this reading is going to be titled, Fire Signs. Don't go back to the past. It's a trap because you have new money, new love, and new life coming up ahead. Okay, guys? Let's get the messages. The, there's a lot of people getting exposed as well, so that might come out in this reading. I don't choose what messages come out. You know what I mean? Like, people could sit there and say whatever they want about me. But I know one thing I'm, I stand for is the truth. You know, I, I can't stand liars. Like, you don't got to lie. You could just, like, just be yourself regardless of what. I love myself regardless, even with all my flaws, because nobody's perfect. But I'm here to give you guys the truth, so... Like, don't shoot the messenger if the message comes out and you guys are triggered, okay? But all I'm saying is that someone's in the Ten of Swords. Actually, somebody's in the Eight of Swords. My bad. I thought that was the Ten of Swords. But someone's in the Eight of Swords energy, okay? Because they walked away from you guys. They turned around and now they want to come back with the Eight of Cups, okay? Because the Eight of Cups in the upright is like somebody walking away, whatever, moving away, you know, leaving a situation. In the reverse, it's like somebody's coming back. Somebody's regretful and they want to come back. But I don't know what their intentions are, really, because they're in this energy, in the Eight of Swords energy. They're feeling stuck and trapped. Wow. Hmm. Yep. Yeah. And things are not going good for them with the Four of Pentacles in reverse. They're losing stability. They're losing finance. The tower has hit in their life. The, the karma has... The energy has reversed, okay? Whatever they've been sending you. This doesn't have to be your ex only. This is family members too and fake-ass friends that you guys cut off. So I'm not going to sit here and tell you guys, oh, the past is coming back, take them black, back, blah, blah, blah. You should help these people. These people, they're getting karma for what they did to you. So if you want to help them, that's on you. But um, this is their karma and you shouldn't interfere in their karma because that can backfire on you guys and, and sabotage what you guys have coming forward. Okay, don't say I didn't warn you guys. Mm -hmm. There's a Knight of Pentacles in reverse. Okay, Knight of Pentacles in reverse, right? Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, energy. This person's not having things going in their favor. This person is in reverse for a reason. It's because this person's a karmic in your life, right? Even this could even be a child. This could be a son, an older son that's a karmic in your life. It doesn't matter. We could have karmics as our children too. So this is a this could be a younger energy as well, right? But this person been playing too many games. Okay, and now you became the star, and now you became successful fire signs. Now you're starting to glow and shine bright like a diamond. Shine bright like a diamond. Shine bright like a diamond. You guys are the star, okay? Yeah, and I feel like I wish that I could have this moment for life. You guys are being recognized on the stage as a star. Some of you guys becoming famous. Some of you guys actually in the public eye. People love you so much for your original, uh, you know, you're just original. You're just like, whatever you do, you're just like very sincere, okay? People know that you are the star. You're, ris you're a rising star, right? And that's what I'm saying. You got to be careful because you're shining right now. And all the past people are watching you, right? These karmics are watching you. Yes, like I said, I can't make it up. Thank you, Spirit. Wow, can't make it up. The star card and the eight of cups in reverse. Somebody knows that you're the star. 
Somebody knows that you're successful. Somebody knows that you're rising. You're a rising phoenix, okay? Because they've been getting readings or they've been watching and keeping tabs. But here goes the Eight of Cups in reverse. They literally want to come back to you. They're trying to come back to you at all costs. They want to literally figure out a way how to get into your life. Maybe they're coming in with this genuine offer because they love you. But maybe most of them, they're not. They're just coming in to try to ride off your coattail or something because they're losing shit. And now they want you to help them. Wow. Okay, just wow. Give me the message, spirit guides and angels for the beautiful fire signs. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, watching this video. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for your love and your support on my channel, guys. I love you guys, my fire signs. Yes, you're getting the Ace of Wands. Yes, you're getting a beautiful offer. You're getting an unexpected event to go in your favor. And somebody's very, very passionate and attracted to you guys. And I feel like this is someone that's wealthy, that's on their throne, that has their own business, that's on your guys' vibration. This person wants to come in and make you a con make a connection with you. You could be dealing with another Aries Leo Sag, but this person is coming in quick, right? And the past people, they're watching Okay, and there's someone in specific that's around you that's not really happy for you. You have a fake friend that's really envious. I heard the name Carol or Caroline. Well, here we go, spirit. Call him out, spirit. Call him out. Okay, as soon as I said that, I started to hear names. I heard the name Carol or Caroline. Loretta. Fake friends, they're not happy for you. These are your karmics, okay? And if this is your name, then this is confirmation. This is your reading. This message is for you. Wow. So I heard um, Reggie. I heard Lorraine. Leslie or Lisa. Danny. And Rob or Robert. Keisha or Lisa, Keisha, okay, strength in reverse, you guys, let me tell you something, somebody feels so defeated by your glow up, somebody feels like so freaking intimidated by your glow up, they feel like the strength in reverse, okay, because this person knows that now you are, have access to this power, this energy, this passion, you have a passion for something that you're starting, you have a passion for your purpose or your calling or your new business, and this is what I'm trying to tell you, there's people that feel defeated by this because you're winning, okay, and they don't freaking like it too much, wow. Oh, can't make it up. Where did it go? There's a card that flipped. Oh, yeah, I already said they're in the Four of Pentacles in reverse. This just came out again to confirm the message, guys. Okay? Someone's losing shit. <clears throat> and they're losing the strength because... Karma's a bitch, right? The tower. Exactly! They're losing shit. They're losing strength because you're fucking winning. And they don't know how the hell they're going to come and, and get back into your life now because you barely know this person anymore. You're not even paying them no mind. You don't even see them. You're too busy becoming the star. And they're too busy having the tower. Wow. Can't make it up, right? Because these people were foolish. This person was a fool for not choosing you guys. And this tower's coming to hit this fool right in the face. Okay, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy over here. Okay, we have Aries, Leo, Sag energy over here and Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, water energy. But you're coming out victorious. Fire signs, you're coming out on top. You're winning. Wrongs being made right. Justice in your favor in court and family members getting exposed. Okay, because you're walking away. You put down the swords. You're not in this five of swords energy, but these people are. They're literally fighting amongst each other now. Like, I, I put this up earlier. The past is watching, okay? But you guys are too busy winning, and um, you're not giving a shit. Like, I feel like you guys are unbothered, and you know that these people, they're doing the most to obstruct your good energy. And some of you guys, you were dealing with, you're dealing with someone that was wealthy and that had money, that thought that they could overpower you because they, they had money or whatever, or they was going to pay a lawyer to sign off on an inheritance. This family member had money, so they probably try to orchestrate things against you or this ex here. This person was a karmic with money, okay? Karmic male here. Karmic male using separation spells. Someone was using separation spells, covering shit up, doing the most. Mm -mm -mm. Heaven's always watching over us. 
You know that fire signs? Heaven is always watching over you guys. And you have a brother. Something's going on with your brother. Maybe he betrayed you. Maybe he worked against you too. Something's happening with this brother. This brother could be going through bad health. This brother could be facing legal issues. This brother could have addictions. This brother's being spiritually attacked. I don't know what this brother did. But something with this brother here. Okay. Someone spiritually attacking this brother. I don't know. But something with a brother and people working in a team against you guys. Exactly. Fire signs. Let's get the truth. Let's get the clarity. Archangel Michael, Spirit out. Anna, speak to me clearly. Give me the messages, ancestors. What do you want to say to the fire signs watching this video? Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Yeah. And they were working with a crooked agent. Um, They were, um, okay. For some of you guys, for the, for the fire signs resonating with the part where your family stole your inheritance... Or they were literally covering up, covering up a planned murder. They wanted to take you out and sacrifice you for your gifts and your sole purpose. They were um, working with a private investigator illegally following you around, okay? Spying on you guys, trying to get information, digging up dirt from your past. They're being watched by the FBI. They're going down. They're, the feds are watching. There goes your inheritance right there. Like I said, all these past people, they think that you're doing spell work to them because whatever they've been doing is just unraveling and all their lives are being shut down as we speak. They're losing shit because they worked against you. Here goes a brother again. Mm -mm -mm. Bad health or something's going on. A sister too. A sister could have been involved, guys. Oh my goodness. The vine is in control of your blessings. So you have nothing to worry about, fire signs. Somebody new or somebody that you're meant to be with is coming in because they love you and they want to marry you guys. So if you're dealing with someone that's coming in and out for sex, they're trying to hold on to your energy, they're karmic, they're toxic, let that go. Let it go. If he ain't gonna love you the way he should, let it go. Let it go. Because you guys have a whole new world coming in and these past people like fucking leeches trying to stop you guys. Remember that. So I'm not here to tell you wait for nobody from the past. I'm here to tell you to move on. You gotta move on. Yeah, you're getting a sudden pay of money. And they literally get in reading so they know. So that's why they're all coming back. They're watching or they're trying somehow to get back into your life to sabotage it. Okay? Moving in together. Yeah. Um, maybe someone's trying to move in with you. Be careful. This person probably homeless. They probably need to use you or something. This person had all these options, cheated on you with all these other people in the past, or all of a sudden they need your help. I don't know what to say, man. Like, this person is stuck or trapped, or they want to keep you stuck or trapped. Regardless of what, you don't got time for that. Someone's stuck and trapped in toxic energy with a karmic, keep it moving. You don't sit down and wait for nobody to put you on a shelf so then they could come and take you and pick you up whenever they want and put you back. You're not going to be on standby for nobody, fire signs. You guys are too mu motherfucking beautiful and passionate to be doing that. You can have whatever you like. You can have whatever you want. You hold the power. I feel like these karmics are all like being brought down. There goes an aunt trying to steal your damn inheritance. That aunt is sick. That aunt could be passing or she literally going to jail too. I don't like that aunt vibe I get. I'm sorry. Separation spells doing the most. A father and your aunt involved. A father betrayal here. Guys, I'm sorry, but this reading went left. I'm telling you, this is what's coming out. I don't make it up. It's energy. You guys see the cards popping up. Something with an uncle. Some of you guys are going to actually find out that your uncle's your real father and your dad was it was all an orchestrated bullshit lie between your family members because they were trying to sacrifice you because they were trying to cause you trauma. Maybe your uncle left you an inheritance. Maybe he um, always knew he was your real father. And if that's not the case, that's not for everybody. Please don't come at me in my comments. Some of you guys are actually dealing with that. Your mother kept a secret or there was a secret or this somehow this uncle could have been... um. Touching or abusing you guys when you were young. Something to do with an uncle. For some of you guys, an uncle passed and left you something. That was your real father. Your mother lied. For some of you guys, this uncle was a, a fucking pig. Or they are. Or they are drunk. Or they touch or abuse children. They're going to jail for that. For touching children. So take the message how it resonates. Don't take the message if it doesn't. That's for someone else. Yeah, like I said, this mother's keeping secrets about your father. Or keeping secrets regardless. 
and there's money in her hand. And she was not trying to let that shit go. She's been trying to hold on to your energy and money for a while now. Moon and the secret's coming out. I heard the name Stacy and Lori. I heard Lori. Loretta. I heard Loretta. I heard Car Carol or C Carol. Carol. Kelly. DeAndre. I heard DeAndre. Marcus or Demarcus. Fake friends. Yeah. You guys have a lot of fake ass friends that were always in cahoots. There's a death in the family coming up. Someone been working with your ex against you the whole time, and now they want to act like they want to come back and fix a connection? No! That was a karmic for a reason. Let that person go. They want to repair a connection because they're going through this. Okay? They're being exposed. And you guys have a successful business. So why would you want to have these past people come back into your life right now when um they're covering up shit? Like, they use spell work on you guys. You don't, you don't take nobody in your life that did spell work on you. Hell no. That person's a karmic. Somebody really loves you, they will never do that. I heard the name Destiny. Denise and Destiny. Out of nowhere. Desiree. Will you marry me? Somebody's coming in. Somebody wants to marry you guys. This is your real soulmate. The letter J, K, or L. Jeanette. Janet. Jesse or Jessica. John. James. Jules, I heard Jules. Jamie, I heard Jamie. Jeanette, or Janet, the letter K. Kendra, Kathy, Kenny, Cole, Keisha, Kanisha, something like that. Kanisha, Kanisha, Kanisha. I already heard the name Lori and Lisa so many times in this reading. Larry, fire sign male, Aries, Leo, Sag. Okay, a mother kept a secret about a father here. I heard the name Lester. Ew, I heard that name Lester. I don't, I'm sorry, but I don't like that name. Private investigation or private investigator watching you guys or watching these people here. If these people keep inviting you to eat at their house, don't freaking eat the food. Fire signs, I've been warning you guys. Don't be taking people's food right now. If somebody's hiding this secret with their sexual, dark sexual secrets, touching kids or touching children or being gay. They're getting exposed, right? The letter A, B, or C. Arlene, Amanda, Billy, Bethany. I already said Carl, Crystal, Cindy. Cynthia, Kelly, wow, there's too much going on here. Too many names I'm hearing all crazy. A lot of people are involved here. They're getting exposed. Focus, my loves. These people have been trying to do confusion spells on you for a very, very long time. And they are backfiring. And this is why they're going through confusion themselves right now. Because they're confused, fire signs. They don't know how you was able to shine bright like a diamond. They don't know how you was able to heal and rise up. Too bad for them. They didn't do the inner work. Too bad for them. They wasn't chosen like you guys are. Yeah, exactly. Couple last messages for the fire signs. Aries, Leo, Sag. Sex crimes, going to prison. Somebody's going to prison. Somebody got a sick-ass family member doing this shit. Focus, family me um, family members are trying to confuse you and an ex, but there's a confession coming. These people are energy vampires, soulless beings, clones. I already said. You guys will be going on a vacation to celebrate soon. You're getting a huge payout. This money is owed to you guys. Listen, they've been trying to gain money off of your information for so long. It's a wrap. This shit is done. It's over. Okay, let me tell you, it's just over. I just, I get annoyed when I tap into this energy, guys. So please, just don't mind me, because I'm, I'm a real empath. So when I'm reading and I'm channeling, I feel the energy. I feel what you guys are feeling, and it's just disgusting already. It's about time these karmics get brought to justice. It's about time you guys um have what's owed to you guys, okay? If you guys are needing a personal video, there's still $25. Email me down below. I'll send it to you the very next day, guys. Okay? And, um... Yeah, this is your message, my beautiful fire signs. Till the next time, I love you guys so much. Namaste.